Hey guys, Pete here with GIS Solutions, and today I'm going to show you how to add the layer control button to your leaflet web map. The layer control button allows you to toggle between different base maps by having a little toggle button on the upper right hand side of your map. I'll leave a link above to a previous video I did where we created a basic web map and it'll include this basic HTML structure. So the first thing we want to do is under the script where we have our OSM base map, we want to create a variable. OSM equals add to base map. So this, with this statement here, it's going to be the default. So we want to add some other base maps to it. So if we go over to our internet browser here, sorry, I have a couple screens up here. And we go over to um, leaflet, base map providers. You'll find a lot of different base maps here that you can select from. Now, one of the caveats is that we need, we're going to copy this code here, but we need to have the code that has the extent here. So let's go ahead and use this one. So stamen watercolor. Copy that. We'll paste it right here. And I'll just take out, so we're going to call it stamen watercolor. And let's go ahead and add another one. We'll come back here. Terrain. Again, it has the extent right here. So let's copy this. Okay. Okay, so we have stamen terrain, stamen watercolor, and our open street map. So the next thing we need to do is go down below and we will come it out. We'll say leaflet air control. Create a variable. Base maps. Cool. So we will, in the single quotes, it's what we're going to call it on the web map. So OSM, I'll call it capital, I'll say open street. Okay. And then the actual name is OSM, comma. The next one is stamen watercolor. Let's say watercolor. And the actual name is stamen watercolor. Finally, let's do the stamen terrain, which is right here. I'll just simply call it terrain. The actual name is stamen terrain. Okay, so we'll finally we'll go down and we'll add the Layer control, L control, layers, these maps, add to map. Okay, we'll go and save this and we'll come back. For map, I'll refresh it. Now you can see here's the the toggle button. So we have our open street map, which is the default. We have the watercolor and the terrain. Now, if I refresh it, it goes back to the open street map because again, that was the default. And we could uh, see that by having this add to map statement here. Anyway, I hope that helps. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below. And as always, thanks so much for watching and please like and subscribe if you enjoy this. Thanks so much.